Well, hello. How y'all doing? This is L.A. in town. What's up? Are y'all ready to talk about the news or y'all want to hear the weather? I want to hear something good about it, you know. But ain't nothing good in the world right now. You know, happiness is hard to find, but I'm going to tell you something. And uh, there's a lot going on in the world today, and I send prayers out to everyone. I send love and light to everyone. And let's have a little prayer. Thank you, Father in Heaven. Protect everyone here. Give everyone happiness at their home. Give them safety of what's going on right now. Guide them in the right direction they need to be. Help them protect their homes. And, and also protect my area, my space, and my homes. And check the children at the door with these concerts and all the stuff. Please check them at the door. Because there's a lot we want to do. But, you know, hey, we got to, we know if we put ourselves out there, what's going to happen. But text the name of Amen. I always say a little extra prayers so don't nobody get they, they deal out of water. Okay? I believe in Almighty too. Okay? Everybody think because you do these cards. Oh, you don't believe in nothing. Yes, we do. We believe. We just believe that people in their energies are so jacked up. If you're trying to be good to somebody, let me check this out. Now, Aries. Now, y'all have good natures. And sometimes y'all got to be boss natures. And then when y'all get in y'all boss who people don't like that. You know, everybody don't like that boss suit because it's like you bossing them. You telling them what to do. You controlling their life. Sometimes some of you, no friends, need bossing. Need guidance. It's the bottom line. It's nothing wrong with little guidance. It's just who are you going to listen to? That's what you can ask some young people. And that's a lot of it. you know. And I want to tell everybody, send love and light to your house. But I want to see what's going on about this This. Uh, Situation out here. The energies are hot on everyone, but y'all, you know, you need to keep yourself safe from these negative energies because they're floating around trying to first find the next thing to get the stuff and the stuff crack. But can't nothing, like they say, and they used to tell we, we don't crack, so why are we sitting up here cracking now? Why are we gonna sit back and let the world crack us up? It's evil everywhere. Remember that. It's just how you use your instincts. You know when you people don't be paying attention to it, they just go in and go anyway. And then they say, well, well how did it happen? How did it happen over there? Because we wasn't prepared. You can't see the future happening to you. Okay, let's see. What's currently going on in your life, Aries, that we need to discuss at this time? So y'all think what we need to discuss about what's going on in love, money, health, Whatever necessary need to be told. We're going to pull a couple cards on on money too. What Aries direction should be? Spirit? What's currently going on? What's currently going on? This is what we're going to ask yourself. What's going on currently with your half? And what's going on currently in and, and, uh, our outcome to it? Okay, Spirit, what's currently going on? What energies is we dealing with? First, let me pull these energies cards so we'll know. What energies is Aries dealing with in the next... Uh, just put it anytime they see this. When is next 72? Next, What energies are they dealing with in the next 72? Or Just whenever they need to know this. Whenever they see this. I always don't like to put date on nothing because sometimes it goes a little longer. What's going on next 72 with Aries? Aries... Your dreams need a practical plan in the full moon of Taurus. Aries, you need to start thinking your dreams and having a practical plan about them. And then once you get a practical plan, then your dreams will uh, manifest. But you got to be, be thinking a practical plan. You need to come up with a plan. That's the main thing. And the energies you're dealing with is Taurus in the full moon of Taurus. You're dealing with Taurus. You need to get a plan. With this Taurus in the next 72 hours. Or whatever. There's an energy of Taurus that you're going to be dealing with. What other energies? Next 72. Aries has got to deal with. What other energies has Aries got to deal with the next 72? Um, conclusions are within reach in the full moon eclipse. They will let you know there's a conclusion to something that. There is something within your reach. But you're just not seeing at this moment. That means you need to do a little bit more soul searching. Go deep within. Go outside. Look at the bigger picture on the Sagittarius moon. They want you to start looking. Look at the bigger picture. To everything you got going on. They want you to look at the bigger picture. 
of what you got going on the next 72 hours too. What else? Something turned over, y'all. Okay, it says, uh, Super Moon, emotions going to be running high. Remember this. Emotions are going to be out of control. Everybody going to be losing their freaking mind. But you know what? Your loved ones are safe. They want you to know it's at the bottom. So, anyway, you're safe. But also remember, instincts always works. It works for me every time. Okay, what emotions? We're going to find out what's running high. What emotions is running high? Let's see. What's running high currently with uh, Aries? What's going on currently that their emotions are running high with it? I see that's the most situation we need to talk about. Next 72. Spirit, give me inside. What's the emotions is running high? What they going to be so excited that, that their emotions are... You got to watch your emotions because they're going to be up and down. In other words, you're going to be feeling sad. You're going to be feeling glad. You're going to be, but you're going to look at the better picture of it. Don't let evil win. This is what I'm telling you. What's going on? What's the emotions running high for? What is Aries against? Why is their emotions running so high in the next 72? Or whenever they first see this and then get started. Why is their emotions running high? Love, money, health, whatever it is. Your emotions are running high. There's a lot of people who are going to be fighting. For one thing, this was in reverse. Some people are fighting, but I think it meant to go straight up because it did sideways. But some people are in conflicts and their emotions are running high. I don't like to read in reverse because sometimes you get reverse, you're going to get negativity too. So I will if I have to. Why is the five of wands here for emotions running high? Why is the five of wands here for that? too many. Why is the five wands here for that? For emotions running high. So some people are going to be fighting in the next 72 hours. It's going to get real deep. And it's all because of two of pentacles. Someone's trying to ju juggle too much in a situation. What else going on with Aries? What else is they doing? Also we have the, the, the moon. Okay. Someone's emotions going to be running high because they don't see their manifestation happening. Someone did something to, to start something. In other words, someone may have Aries went out to do something, but it got returned. The magic that someone sent out allegedly got returned. Someone was trying to mess with your emotions, but they're not having it. They're tired of that. So whoever dare try, they're going to get it reversed back to you because they said they're tired of that. So... Somebody's not going to be able to manifest what they're wanting. So what's going to happen to this Aries for them trying to put magic on Aries? What the, what's going to be their fate? Aries next for them putting magic on Aries. What's going to happen to Aries next? What's the good? What's going to happen for Aries next for them putting magic? Okay, the five of swords. This makes you look back for your enemies and you say, I don't give a crap. I'm ready. I ain't backing down to none of you mofos. You got to say, you got to stand in your power. Some of you want to retreat. Some of you five swords, you want to run for your problems. But you know you ain't no coward. Whoever this is, this Aries is trying to stand in their power. But they also run when it's necessary. They stay out in the sheet. They're not running because they're scared of you. They're running because they want to save your life. That's exactly what I hear. That's why they run it. Because, you know, some of you have the seven of cups. You're coming out of that illusion with too many choices. You don't let your head, your eyes ruin your... You're starting to think better than what you was at first. In other words, you're going to walk into something. You're not going to walk in it because they're not going to let you do it. You're not tending on walking into no fight with nobody. You usually trick that fight. I'm a lover. I'm not a fighter. That's the best way to be. Once you start going beyond character, people try to lock you up. But once you start realizing what the heck they do it, you don't play they don't play themselves. And that is exactly what I see here. Somebody's playing them they play themselves. Cause let me show you what comes up next. For them trying to do trying to put them spells on their ears. Look. 
They put your ass to rest. Excuse my French. They put all these spell people to rest. This force world. Stressed out. Trying to do something to this Aries. Whoever this is. This air sign. They stressed out. Somebody stressed out because they can't achieve what the hell they want to. Because the Ace of Swords. Guess what? They will not. And let me make it, let me let me say it to you, like God said, there will not be nothing happen to this area. So you can try if you want to, but they are gonna triumph anyway. So all you doing is making yourself look like you're a sore loser. That's what I call people when they done when they they're a sore loser because they can't get nothing, they can't get no reaction, so they're gonna try another reaction, and they're gonna try something else to get a reaction. But you don't know, they don't know you got protectors too. See, that works good. You throwing something, you don't know who that person knows. So we're gonna get the answers. I'm finna, I'm finna put some little damp on it, cause I wanna know something before we move on. Since so somebody wanna play spells, but it got reversed. Let's see who reversed it. You want, you want more details? Let me break it down to you. Let me break it down to y'all. Cause God ain't playing that. People saying. This person ain't being watched. You messing with his kind now. Now you God got the sword. Now if you lie, but and like I said, I for an eye, two for two. And I keep hearing that. So you better watch yourself. Whoever going on this area, they better walk on the right side of the building. Cause this area is blessed with all kinds of stuff. You beyond your imagination. And people don't know it, cause that person is good at covering it up. <laughs> Okay, let's see. What else you want them to know about them trying to attack this Aries under this emotional situation? What's going to happen? What else? What else is going to happen with them trying to put spells on this Aries? What else is happening to them, Spirit? What is their karma? What's going to happen to them for trying to put spells? Who's protecting this Aries? Who's protecting Aries at this time? Let's see. Who's protecting Aries? Did you understand it? It's a tarot reader. <laughs> a very tarot reader is very protected. So, you're not messing with that. Because, you know, this tarot reader is trying to, didn't, didn't have no foundation. So they thought they were going to steal or try to disrupt this tarot reader. But this tarot reader ain't nothing but Ain't nothing but a do thing, baby. What else? You need to know what's going to happen to him. So you better get your, you know, what's going to happen for try to mess with this Aries. Look. It's concealment. This Aries, you know, it's concealment. It's taken care of. It's been reversed. Everything they do is reversed. Look, hex banished. So, hey, what you want to talk about? Let me tell you, you read it for yourself. Read it, read it. It's been banished. So leave Aries alone, whoever this is. You need to stay off Aries' page because you ain't doing nothing but making it. Uh, who banished this? Okay, yeah. Because you don't know who you mess with. A high priestess. This is a high priestess. This is somebody. You should have never called up on that person's name. This person got lineage on the other side. Which you didn't even know that's a decoy for y'all butts. Don't get it. You don't get it. You're going up against somebody that you can have no business. Nothing. Because Adam, you sealed your fate. Adam, you sealed your fate. That's all I heard. Allegedly, you sealed your fate, Adam. He messing with this person. Because, check this out. There's some secrets that God revealed. It got turned around. Because you try to mess with the wrong high priestess. Y'all don't know fate between the real. But you will learn. Keep messing with this one. This one going to teach you something. For it's always, she's going to clean you of your sins. And you ain't going to be able to walk. Because you think you know this person. But you do not know what they're here to do. <laughs> keep playing with them. Like they say, keep throwing a rod. And you shall get the rod. Eye for an eye. A two for a two. And that's all I can tell you. That's what I heard. And God, people don't think God getting don't let don't like when you mess with his spine. It's gonna tissify. 
it's going to return that it's the, the tissue is returned back to you return back to center so I'm going to leave that alone God ain't playing yeah and, and it was all because Seattle work and this union somebody want this union somebody is mirroring but they get in the ace of cups and what the heck God is right there mark it and read God's right there you cannot mess with this one so you better get off that page that's all I can tell you God not playing with that he has banished that and he said I got you that's all he can tell you and I'm going to leave it at that he got you with these loops y'all playing these little brooms you still want to play with brooms do you know how to dust off and clean up before you play with brooms because you have no clue you done made dust on your own self put that way put it this way you have been called out and you ain't broke nothing. See, baby, look, ain't nothing stop because you feel like it's a stop. God say, not here, not here. You have been warned. Now let's leave that subject alone. You have been warned. Leave this Aries alone because you do not know who this Aries is. You do not have a clue. You will get deep punishment that you'll never forget. And that ain't no cop. That just put it. That's no caps. You, you, I walk out of here today. Or whoever uh, is this area talking about. And you don't shoot. Y'all don't shield this down and cut that. And stop all that capping. On the other side. Trying to tell the other side. Because the other side I already know who this is. Y'all the dumbest that don't. Because you got to go and get your wishy broom. Get your little brooms on. I'm going to find out who that area is. And you're going to find yourself in the pits of hell. And there ain't no caps. And you been warned. And that's allegedly. Don't nobody come after me. Because I already told you. That's what the message says for you. Now let's see. What else you want to tell this lovely Aries at this time? What's going on with them? So it's a lot of people fighting over you Aries. At this next seven weeks. Young folks are going to be fighting. And there's going to be a lot of stuff going down. But these people better under control their temper. They're going to be going down, down. That's all I can say. You will get your old trip downtown. Young people, it don't matter. Young, old, in between. And then when they take you downtown, they're going to strip your wings. You don't want to go there. It says, the fairy ring. <laughs> what was I just saying? Wait a minute now. Hey, this this ain't no cap. This ain't no Ford. This ain't even putting it little. This ain't chicken little. This is just straightforward. I got to get. I gotta make sure I'm looking at this. I got my... It says new skills, advancement, training, and improvements. I told you number 37. The more you come after this one, the more improvements you're going to give this one. This one's going to get an upgrade while you sit up there and oh, Please come back and forgive me. You better watch who you throw stones at. I keep telling y'all, do not have a clue. You want to know. Ask God. See what he tell you. Because you keep curiosity. Stop being curious. Let's play the game right. Because, uh, I will because that's what he said. Let's play the game right. It says a time to say goodbye. Something about something is about to end for now. The number thirteen. Somebody thought that somebody was gonna be gone. But it got reversed back to them. Oh my god. So whatever you put out for this Aries, they saying they reversed it back to you. So you wonder what you gonna do, cause I don't wanna be boss of that. Now we have your imaginative friend, childhood treasures resurface. Some of you have childhood friends. They resurface. It says the unending sadness of looking back. Somebody keeps looking back with regret, going back, and they can't go past that regret. But Alice in a sea of tears, cast away, out among, feeling abandoned. Someone was cast away like a piece of trash. Remember who you cast away into the dirt. That's what I'm hearing. Now you shall reap what you sowed. What you put to another shall be returned back to you ten times fold. That's what I heard. Take it where you want to. That's what I heard. I'm just stating what I heard. 
If we, that's why if it's every whoever, whoever doing it, but I believe it's the other person trying to do this on the Aries. But Aries don't care, because guess what? The moon. I will watch over you. There's someone watching over you. This person's so protected, she can't even go to the bathroom. Or he can't even go to the bathroom without people falling. Y'all done went too far. <laughs> Y'all done went too far with this Aries. I told you, leave it be. Or cast yourself out into death. Because I ain't going to do it. Y'all on your own. And that's, what I, that's my warning to that. This person is very highly protected. And y'all done pissed them off. I don't want to be in y'all. I don't even want to talk about it. I'm going away from this energy. Because this energy is deep. This energy is all about jealousy and bull freaking. And I'm going to say it with S. Bottom line. Y'all be ashamed of yourself. All you can think about is putting pills on. Be put on yourself. You just did it yourself. What's all you little ratchet people want to do? I can't stand a person. Excuse me if you ain't not talking about everybody. You know who ratchet and who ain't. So don't go say I'm talking about anybody on this channel. I respect everybody. But I cannot stand somebody that, that cannot get take their lickings and get back up and learn from that, that butt whooping and learn from somebody else so you can be a better person. You got to take your life. Oh, you got to go down. You got to go down. Like this is a competition. Straight competition. Aries ain't with no competition. They boss. This particular Aries is running shit. And I'm putting it to you exactly. They running their stuff. And that ain't literally putting it. I'm putting in what they told me to say just like that. They don't care if they like it or not. They running their stuff. Now you need to just sit back and learn. That's all I got to tell you. And that's for you the next 72. Somebody playing games and got to reverse back to them. They don't know how to quit. They can't stop. Fame is eating them up. But guess what? He's just making that person happy. Keep getting that money. Whoever you are, let them hate you. Because more hate, they're giving you money. Ain't nothing. Give it to me. I love my abundance. Set me free.